Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem 57 in chapter 17. Chapter 17 is about temperature, thermal expansion, ideal gas law. So there we need to find how many molecules of air are in each breath. You intake that were also in the last breath Galileo take. So now we can see the breath Galileo take at the last time and then this is a breath of the air has been just uniformly distributed in the air since his death. Do you agree? So Galileo takes the last breath and this air just goes out from his mouth and then uniformly distributed in the earth on the earth. Agree? Yes. Now in this case we can consider how many molecules from the last space, last breath of Galileo. So the number of molecules for Galileo's last breath. So this is the number key, right? So we need to find the, uh, this is number of n, so we need to find n. Now we can see what the quantity given. First one, pressure, standard pressure, right? And then volumes, it tells us just the two liter, convert unit to the meter cube, and k is a constant. Temperature. So the air's temperature we can consider is 27 centigrade, agree? Okay? And then it's around 300 kilo, kilowatts. No problem. Now we can have the ideal gas equation PV equal to NKT, right? So we find the uh, molecules, the number of molecules uh, in Galileo's last breath equal to PV divided by KT. Input known quantity. Get the answer there. Right? Yes. And this is the number of the molecules. Now we find we need to find how much space we have on the earth, right? So we can see the earth's uh, radius is uh, given. You can check on your test book. And then H is also given in the tell us it is around 10 kg high. So this H is given. Therefore, this V air, so volumes for air is a 4 pi R squared times H. Agree? 4 pi R squared is the surface, uh, the areas for the Earth's surface times H volumes for air. Right? Now we can find um, the, we use the number of molecules in Galileo's last breath divided by the total volumes for the air. Then we find for one meter cube, we have the 9.6 times the power, 10 power 3 molecules. Agree? This is the Galileo molecules in per meter cube. Agree? Now this person, you just breathe in a, in a air 2 liter. How much is the molecules we have? So we use the, this number, this density, right? This density times the V, 2 liter. We get it, just 19 molecules. Thank you.